Hey guys, welcome back to A Dose of Chrissy. Thanks for joining me again. If you're new, welcome to the channel. If you're coming back, welcome back. Make sure you, everybody make sure right now you turn on your post notifications so you know when your girl's posting a new video. Um, and if you like this video at the very end, give it a thumbs up. Today I'm coming to you with a Try It Tuesday series. I'm just trying something new. I have a whole bag of just a whole bunch of makeup um, little testers um, foundations that I want to try um, so I just thought why not I just make a little series out of it um, and it won't be every Tuesday it'll kind of be just I'll just drop it on a Tuesday um, so yeah if you want to get into what I'm trying this Tuesday, stay tuned. Okay guys, let's go ahead and get into it. So first off, I'm gonna start off with my, um, well first I have, um, my eyebrows are already done. I have put on my moisturizer, First Aid Beauty. And now I'm going to use this Proteiny Polypeptide Cream from Drunk Elephant. So um, this does feel pretty light. It doesn't feel thick or anything. Feels pretty light, but it does feel um, full coverage. Feels really good too. Feels really good. Oh wow. Feels really good. Um, what else does it say? Improves the skin's appearance of tone, texture, and firmness. Okay. And next we're gonna be going in with a primer that I've been wanting to try. Farsali primer. This is the skin skin tune blur perfecting primer serum and it's a hybrid primer that softly blur blurs the skin reduces the appearance of pores imperfection creates a bright fine-tuned effect usually I just see them like put it on their faces but I don't have the dropper so I'm just gonna put some of this on the back of my hand and kind of just dab it and rub it in and it looks pretty milky, but it's kind of thick. I see Jackie Ina, she uses it and she, you know, she really puts it in these creases here. I'm just putting it in the places where I feel like I really want to really blur the skin out. I'm gonna go in with this Makeup Forever Step One Base Lip and Eye Primer. I'm not gonna use it on my eyes, but I am gonna use it on my lips just to see how it does. Okay, I'm gonna wipe this off because you don't need a lot. And I thought it was gonna be a little bit more um, creamier smells like makeup product um okay so it's a base it's it's really just a base it's nothing creamy it's it's, it's not a lip gloss or anything like that we have our skin blur on and next we're gonna go in with this okay it feels soft it smells it doesn't smell bad the Pore Professional Pro Primer. Okay, so soft radiance. Um, looks kind of ashy. Doesn't look so radiant. But we'll see. I'm gonna be trying out, trying um, everything out with um, a foundation that I already use. I'm not gonna switch that up. Grab our good old 430. And since this is just the regular foundation part, go ahead and lay this and we'll be right back okay guys we're back um, concealers on faces contoured T let me know down in the comments how you're feeling it and 
And for concealer, I have 470, but I tried 490. They didn't have 480, so um, I just got a sample of 490. Um, okay, so I have my concealer on. Okay. One thing about this concealer, I have to make sure it like really gets down into the, so it just sits everywhere. But um, I am gonna be trying a different uh, uh, setting powder. I'm gonna be trying honey underneath the eyes. Whatever is left right up here, I'm just gonna like press this in because there's not too much left on. I just don't want it to set. Hella crazy, which look at that. It's like, it's kind of looking kind of weird, right? Only because I feel like it's looking kind of weird. I'm gonna take another powder brush. I'm just gonna brush this off. You guys, look at that. I mean, like I said before, I'm not worried about it, but I don't want it to be enhanced. So maybe this shouldn't be used for baking. Hold the phone, we gotta fix this. Okay, we're back, cause that was ridiculous. Um, I'm gonna try honey again, but this time I'm gonna use the powder brush and I'm just gonna dust it on there. I'm not gonna bake, cause that was freaking crazy. Okay, so how do we feel, honey? I definitely think that it is lighter than cashew. Um, this definitely brings that honey tone to my face, a little bit browner, but definitely brighter. Just to kind of contour underneath that. I am gonna go all over with nutmeg. Trying to fix this highlight a little bit. I just don't want it to look. I just kind of want it to blend between the two. There is, I think, oh, just one more thing I do want to try. But we're going to do a little bit of eyeshadow and be right back. Hey guys, we are back. And we're going to do one more. We're gonna try one more thing. I did my eyes off camera. If you wanna see how I achieved this look, then gotta wait for that video. Um, it might be up maybe at the same time, maybe after this, but whenever this goes up, I'll definitely try and tag it in this video when it does. So I'm going in with the Makeup Forever Artist Colored Pencil, and this is in the color whatever black. Oh snap, that. My waterline. Sometimes like if I just go in there like crazy, it won't water. So my eye watered a little bit. I'm trying to catch the rest of this. Um, with the other line, line, eyeliner, this kind of would have been like rubbed off already. I'm not gonna go with go in with any more. I like the way that looks, but I am gonna go on over here at this side. But I do like to bring that, bring it in. Okay, that's it. I know, I know you want me to stop eyes. I know, I know. Yes. This is the final, final look. But thank you guys for joining me on this Try It Out Tuesday look. We tried a lot of stuff. Um, if you have any questions about anything, let me let me know down in the comments. Um, the In the description box should be everything that I use. If there's anything missing, let me know. If there's something specific that you wanted to know about, let me know. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for joining me. Share this look with a friend. Um, subscribe, turn on your post notifications, and give it a thumbs up. Thank you guys. See you next time.